<laughs> there is a never ending struggle to make affordable, accessible, high quality health care available to every resident in the state of Maine, from as far north as Fort Kent to down south in York. In between, in Dover Foxcroft, Northern Light Health believes that a merger with Mayo Regional Hospital there works to attain that standard. New Center Samantha Sugarman digs deeper to find out what that merger means for Maine's healthcare industry. Guilford resident Brian Woodworth freely admits he's an older guy. As you age, you kind of get concerned about your own mortality and will I have this specialist here that can take care of my needs at the time. He's not alone. Maine is an aging state, and Dover Foxcroft's town manager, Jack Klukey, says that's the case everywhere, including Piscataquis County. It's really important that people have uh, the health care that they need uh, close to them. That's in jeopardy for Woodworth and Klukey if a proposed merger of Mayo Regional Hospital with Northern Light Health falls through. Mayo has been providing care to residents at a financial loss to the hospital for years. Nobody can imagine uh, a situation where, where we don't have our local hospital. Hospitals do close. And when the hospital closes, it's not good for anybody. Matt State Weed is the senior vice president of strategy at Northern Light Health. He says it's increasingly harder for the smaller rural hospitals like Mayo to make it alone. You see a lot of hospitals really around the country merging and getting into large organizations. There are approximately 3,000 hospital beds in the state. Northern Light Health already manages about a quarter of those beds. By comparison, Maine Health operates a little more than a third, a few more than 1,200 total. There is no grand scheme to um, amass a whole bunch of hospitals as part of Northern Light. But the organization has made it its mission to help local hospitals in financial distress. Northern Light Health acquired Maine Coast Memorial Hospital in Ellsworth in 2015 and Mercy Hospital in Portland in 2013 for the same reason. We absolutely have to keep our hospital open to uh, um, you know, make sure that you know, everybody has access to the health care that, that we need. Access could mean traveling a lot further for the people of Piscataquis County without the merger. Samantha Sugarman, New Center,